What a disgusting, filthy disgrace to humanity you are. I'm crams, Mrs. You're drunk, sir. Nevertheless, I'm crams. <laughs> No, just to want the chimney swept, or just to not want the chimney swept. Oh. Come in. And you can leave that thing outside for the start. Oh, yeah. Come in. Yeah. Two rhymes. Oh, thanks. Nice. <laughs> now then, listen to me, all of you. I've just sheeted all the rooms where there's chimneys to be swept. You brought plenty of soot bags, I see. Well, use them. Because I warn you, one speck of soot in any of those rooms, and not a penny piece will you get from me. Yes, ma'am. Mrs. <laughs> oh, come on, get on with it, then. I'll wait outside, <laughs> Mr Grimes, to, co to collect the, uh, the soot bags. Uh -huh. This will do for them young wretches. <laughs> Oh, hurry 
your blood. Come in, Mr. Grimes. Thomas, we got the old two. Shout, please. I'm not. Money, chimney sweep. Come down the chimney. See? I lost me way. You've come down the chimney, boy? Yeah. But how terrible for you. Aren't you frightened being in the dark? Sometimes, but I'm more frightened of Mr. Grimes. Mr. Grimes? He clouts me. Clouts you? It's me, regular. Cross the year old. Why don't you tell your parents? You what? Your mother and father. I ain't got no mum or dad. Never did. Grimes says I was that shot in the London gutter by the sun. Here. Yeah. You got a mum or dad? No. They died in Vienna last year on holiday. Cool. Not much of a holiday, eh? <laughs> Sorry. Here. Yeah. You got no mum or dad like me. Same sort of difference. Who looks after you then? My uncle and aunt. Sir John and Lady Harriet. Blimey. Royalty. This is their house. Must be worth a few, Bob. Paradise, this is. My idea of paradise. What did you add to him for? Who is he? Jesus. Who? God. He's got the right room for it then, hasn't he? Paradise. What's your name, boy? Thomas. Thomas Aquinas. Something or other. Something or other? Well, you don't get no last name if you ain't got no mum or dad. It's the rules. I'm just Tom. Who are you? I'm Ellie. Ellie? That's a very pretty name, Mason. Highly classy. But it would be, living here. I mean, you couldn't be a Gertie or a Ruby, could you? Living here. I don't know. Please see. Noises are not allowed in this house. Don't. Be careful. Mr. Grimes, what you doing? Believe it. Nobody ever listens to me. I've got something very important. 
important to tell you. Ellie. Dear heart, I just asked that. So have I, dear. I have a right to know. What is it, Mrs. Tripp? I think, my lady. Pinched all the silver, my lady. Pinched the silver? Really? What's pinched, dear? Purloined, my love. Somebody's per... Somebody's stolen the silver. God save the mark. Call the justice, John. Call the justice. I am the justice, dear. Are you really, dear? No one tells me anything. Morning. Stop thief! Stop thief! Stop thief! Stop thief! Stop thief! Someone has pinched me silver. Stop thief! 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 Stop Find that boy, Mr. Masterman. He's been a stealing of Sir John's property. Good as you like, Mr. Grimes. Stop oh, thief. thief! Stop 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 thief! Who in particular are we looking for? Stop thief! Stop! Stop, please. Stop, please. Mr. Massman, Stop, please. please shut up. A boy, Stop, sir. Please. A wicked Stop, boy. Please. Indeed. Stop, Stop thief. There was a lad, minutes ago, running across the fields. It were your lad. I saw Stop, him. Please. Well, he shan't escape. I shall find him and make an example of him. Stop, we'll hunt the young scoundrel, if necessary, across all Yorkshire. To horse! To horse! Oh, my leg, Mr. Lloyd. Come on, Mr. 